what I will tell all of my lovely Facebook girls and boys and everything in between is that for the Black Friday sales, the more you spend, the more gifts you're gonna get. And some of those gifts include one, two, three, go nails. It includes gels. We're gonna be using Maximum Stiletto in 001. We're gonna be giving away happy gels. We're gonna be giving away one, two, three, go nails. We're gonna be giving away candy packs. I'm sorry, not candy packs. We're gonna be giving away um, aprons. We're gonna be giving away the new brush holders and the old ones as well too so lots of really cool things for you to look forward to just remember the more you buy the more you're gonna get our famous pink tote bags so what i'm doing right now is i'm just tailoring the cuticle areas to fit my nail a little bit better Are you guys excited for Thanksgiving? I can't believe it's here already, like a day away. I'm really sad that my dad is not gonna be here with us for Thanksgiving, but hopefully, God willing, for Christmas, we will be out of the hospital and on our way to a recovery. So I got on the lunch. So let's apply the one, two, three, go now. Use a little bit of pressure, push up, hold it. Take your Lux brush wipe, remove any excess gel that might have ran, because you never want to cure the nail with excess gel that ran. And avoid getting it on your skin. Like the plague. Beautiful, there we go. Let's go ahead and bake this for one minute inside the Barbie Darling lamp. Any Black Friday sales, I actually just talked about it at the beginning of the video, so stay tuned tomorrow for all the details on the Black Friday sales. It's going to be huge discounts on all, pretty much every single enocouture.com product, but there will be no free shipping because the discounts are so big. Antonia Cubino Wilson is here! Sales, yes, I will go into detail tomorrow about what the Black Friday and... Um, the sale starts Black Friday, uh, no, the sale starts Thanksgiving, our Black Friday sale will start Thanksgiving, but it will go through Cyber Monday, so it's going to be a five-day sale, and I'm going to give you guys tomorrow what the promo code will be, what the discounts will be, and also um, I'm going to show you guys some of the free stuff that you'll get, because the more you buy, the more free stuff you will get, as well too as gifts, but there will be no free shipping during those five days. So you're going to get a really good sale, you're going to get a lot of really nice fun things, but unfortunately there will be no free shipping because of inflation, because of the rates. So it was either we do a smaller amount of discount, or we, uh, with free shipping, or we do a bigger amount of discount with our flat rate shipping, so we decided to go with the flat rate shipping. So hopefully it doesn't make too many people mad. So right now I'm just taking the file, just you know, really gently touching up the sides, the free edge. I'm going to be using a pink one, which is this really pretty like strawberry lip gloss pink. And the color is like really, really universal for every skin tone as well too. And I'm just using a 240 grit palette to just refine everything, okay? smoothie buffer, remove the entire shine off the surface of the nail. Beautiful. I'm going to keep the shape of this video very, very similar towards to what it came in. I'm going to remove the dust. I already had one person complain about, you know, our unfortunate, very, very small influx in prices. The file went up to $1 each file, which is still, I think, really reasonable for the quality of files that you're getting, plus they're made here in America, so. It's not like I want to raise prices or, you know, charge for shipping or anything like that, but 
Inflation is no joke. It's like being alive in the 70s when Jimmy Carter was pregnant. Look at that color. Oh, so lovely. I heard gas in some parts of California is like $5. That's crazy. I'm going to bake that for actually one minute. I want it to, to dry really, really thoroughly because I'm going to wipe the top surface of the nail. With acetone, you take off the uh, sticky residual to, uh, layer so that way I can put the sticker on and turn around. Won't make me mad, I'm ready for the sale. She's ready. Do you miss doing others' nails or did you just start? Um, what do you mean? Do I miss doing other people's nails? Or, like for the video? In time, totally, totally, totally. I agree, I think I'm I was like, what a rude comment, sir. Do you guys still say what order and numbers you are working on? No, if you have a question about your order, send an email to info at and they'll be able to assist you. Can I back with a credit? Yes, and we have lots of videos on how to do fills with the 123Go system. I'm going to take a little bit of acetone with my new nail pump, and then we're just going to remove the oxygen inhibition layer, aka the sticky layer. Let that dry for a few seconds, so that way we can put our stickers directly on top. Do you have a new camera or is it me? Seems like you're off frame. It's probably me because I don't have a new camera. No, did I miss you doing the other nails? No, I did these on Instagram. I did them on Instagram, but you know, I gotta save my thumb for Facebook. So I used three different stickers because remember you guys, for a design to have composition to for it to tell a story, the more stickers that we use, the better. And I used a variation of white stickers. I can't remember the numbers, I think these are in the 300s, and then the new 3D stickers. This one is so, like, very, like, I don't know, I felt like very, like, cornucopia, or very, like, pumpkin spice, but the design did not turn out pumpkin spice, it turned out very, like, Indian bridal wedding in the fall. So I'm going to use some of these really, really beautiful stickers. This um, particular design actually comes in three colors. It comes in white, black, and in gold. It was funny, I was complaining on Instagram. I hate when people like, I do a design, but they're like, I want to see that design. You should have done it in silver. I don't like gold. Why are you using silver? Because I like gold. I'm like, sweetie, I don't take requests. This is not, you know, call in your favorite song. Uncle Max knows what he likes. That's what happens when you become an old man like me. Even just like that, it looks really pretty actually. You get set in your ways. I'm gonna go in with this beautiful giant sunflower. squares all these like random shapes really finish off the design as you guys can see people do like why would I need to put white squares but it really does create a composition and it brings cohesion to the design when in doubt fill in with squares and circles and stars and hearts and, and glitter tell the story and I feel like doing this it really does kind of like tell the story with the design.
sticker is too close to the edge, just go in and turn the edge, just like that. It's so funny. You guys want to hear me? Uh, you guys want to hear me rant? Is that I we I get emails, or our team does, and they're like, Max, what, do you, what should I say to this person? Because it's like they're complaining about something they have absolutely no control over, and that is the shipping rate to overseas. Like I'll get emails and people say the shipping is too expensive to my country, whether it be the UK or wherever, right? And we're like, um, sweetie. We don't control the shipping rates to the UK if you have a problem with it. You know, reach out to the courier, reach out to your customs agent, you know, to your country. But unfortunately, there's nothing we can do in regards to like shipping rates overseas because we don't determine them. And they're like, why are you at why are you giving me attitude? It's like we're not giving you attitude, we're telling you the truth. And then remember, you guys, even if you're going to be doing velvet, matte nails on top of the stickers, you always want to do two coats of top coat. So I'm just going to keep it thin today, and I'm going to use shiny. And Antonia had brought up something yesterday. She said that she has a problem with her stickers, kind of like the yeah, edges popping up or not laying super smooth. So what you would do is you would do your first coat of top coat, whether it be shiny, whether it be dawn top, whether it be wonder gel, over the whole nail. Cure that fully, okay, all the way through at least one whole minute. And then take a buffer and buff the edges. To remove any edges of the sticker that might have popped up and then remove the dust and then go in with your second coat of top coat. Whether it be velvet, whether it be shiny, wonder gel, down top, whatever you want. But then I would do my second coat of top coat. seconds because I'm just going to go in with one coat of shiny. Oh no, velvet, I'm sorry. Curing all the way. It could be or it could also be the humidity of the air. Especially when our stickers, we if we leave them out or if we leave them in a place where there's a lot of moisture in the air, it does affect the sticker. So I actually put all my sticker books inside of a box and then inside of that box I put those little beads to help absorb moisture. Because I have so many stickers and since I don't do nails every day or I use the same sticker every day, it can affect um, the adhesion of the sticker. So now we're going to go in with a nice coat of velvet. Actually, I'm going to buff it because this one, she stood up a little bit on the edge. So I'm going to carry it just an additional 30 seconds so that way I can buff the top surface of the sticker and get a smooth surface and then apply my velvet. See, it's perfect. I did it on purpose for the demonstration. Oh, I got an email today that Wicked is touring. I'm like, oh, I want to go see Wicked. I have, I saw it years ago. I wish I would have seen it with like Adina Menzel. I personally don't like who they picked for the movie. I don't know who the lady is playing the evil witch is, and I don't like our little Grande, so... Poor me. There we go, see? I just buffed a little wherever with, there was any lifting. I'm going to remove the dust, and now I'm going to go in with my velvet. Nice 
just even put a velvet over the entire nail surface. Very urban goth, not urban goth, I went to like neon goth, punk, cyberpunk fantasy. And then we dropped, I, call, I always say British Vogue, but it's Vogue UK, because it's very much inspired by British Vogue. It's like the pages out of a magazine. And then, Bad USSR, which has more naughty words, because you guys know we love the stickers with the bad naughty words, and it has them in both in English and in Russian. I don't know, I don't think Ariana Grande's voice is that great. And I don't, I mean, I think she's over here. Oh, people are gonna hate me. Look at that! How beautiful it came out. So dope. Let's get a little background. Oh, beautiful, look at that. I feel like I'm getting married with these phalanges. Do you guys love it? Well, my love, that's gonna wrap it up for today's live demo. I hope you guys enjoyed it. This is um, so much fun to do for you. And what can I say? I love you guys. Thank you so much for showing so much love and support to American companies and American manufacturing like us here at enobitour.com. And I will see you guys tomorrow in the next live video. Bye, everybody.